Hi, I'm Johnny with Balloon Animals Palm Beach, and today I'm going to show you how to make a penguin with a festive hat. These are really popular at an event I just did. So what you're going to need is two white 260s, one black 260, one orange 260, and one red heart. You're going to begin by inflating your white 260. Just inflate it until it has an eight or nine finger tail. This one has nine fingers. Now you're gonna go ahead and make a little three finger loop. Pull the nozzle through the loop to lock it into place. And now you're going to make a second three finger loop. Now you wanna make a slightly bigger loop. This one's about five fingers. Twist the balloon around the other loop. So you have this, three loops. All right, now you're going to go ahead and grab your black 260. And you want to inflate it until you have about a six finger tail. Now you're gonna go ahead and set the black balloon against the white loop, the last one that you made. Put a, twi a twist right where it meets the other loops and then you just twist that around one of your three finger loops. And I pull it around to the other side. Now you want to make an eight finger bubble with both the black and the white balloon. And you're gonna go ahead and pull the black balloon back up and twist it into the top here. Okay, so now it's on the other side of the one you just came up on. And you wanna go ahead and pull it down and twist it into this white balloon at the bottom. Now you're gonna make a little two, a little two finger loop for the penguin's tail. Now you can go ahead and get rid of this white. Tie this off. Pull it through the other bubbles just to make it nice and secure. And then you're gonna go ahead and deflate this black balloon as you squish it up in between the other two black bubbles. up and twist it into the white loops at the top. So now what you have is a black balloon coming out the back, a black balloon coming out the front. This is the back of the penguin and the tail. This is the stomach of the penguin. Now you're going to go ahead and grab your red heart and inflate it just a bit right as you can start seeing the humps of the heart showing up. So it's really not much bigger than my hand here. And tie that off near the end of the nozzle so you have some room to twist. Give it a squish. And the first thing you're gonna do, this is the top of the heart here. You're gonna pick one of these humps and you're gonna go ahead and twist a little, you know, about a one finger bubble on one of the humps, take and tie the nozzle of the black balloon around that bubble. I like to go ahead and tie a knot around it just to make sure it stays in place. Then you're going to do the same thing on the other hump. So you're just going to make another little one finger bubble. Squish the top so you have a nice fat bottom to the hat. Stretch this over the white loop and you're going to want to twist the black balloon and the red bubble together. So I make a little one finger bubble with the black balloon and twist those two together. So one is tied with the nozzle and one has two bubbles twisted together. 
grab your white 260 and this one you're going to inflate until it has about a eight, ten, 9 or 10 finger tail. You're just going to go ahead and wrap this around the hat to cover up the bubbles. And I just make one little one finger bubble and twist it. Uh, make another little one finger bubble here. Get rid of the extra. Tie this off. So I've got that in the back. And then you can always just slide it a little bit to the side to give it a little bit of a slant. Take your white 260 scrap. Just inflate it about four or five fingers. I guess I have about six fingers here. And I'm going to just tie, a, tie it into a loop. And now I'm just gonna tie, pull the nozzle through the loop and tie it onto the top of the hat for a little white ball. So there's your little white ball. And now you're ready to add the beak and the feet. So grab your orange 260, inflate it until it has about a 10 finger tail. You're gonna make a small three finger bubble and another small three finger bubble the same size. Twist those two together, pull the nozzle through to lock it into place. Do another little three finger bubble, a four three finger bubble that's the same size, twist that together. Now you're ready to get rid of the extra. You wanna save this for the beak. Tie this off. Loop it through to make sure this stays twisted. Now you're just gonna take the feet and pull them around the tail from the back to the front of the penguin. And I like to twist them around each other to really make sure they get held in place. A little tail helps keep them right where you want them. So that's the feet and the tail. Now we're gonna add the beak. So take your 260 scrap I'm gonna go ahead and cut this down so it's just about four fingers. Pump it up a little bit. So I have a three finger bubble. Tie that off. Now you're just gonna take this tail and wrap it around the head here. So there's the penguin with the beak. Now I'm gonna go ahead and add on the eyes. And the penguin is good to go. So that's how I did the eyes and eyebrows. If you slide this over a little bit, his hat has a little bit of a slat, slant. If you like the video, you can click like below or you can leave me feedback in the comment section. You can subscribe to my channel. I release videos on a regular basis. Or you can check me out on Facebook or my website, balloonanimalspalmbeach.com. Thanks.